In this demo, we'll review the various account settings. The Report Filter setting option can be applied to the folder or account level. From within the folder, click on the Folder Settings tab, then click on the Report Filters tab, or from within the Account Info tab at the top of the page, click on the Filters tab. Report filters allow users to add URLs that they do not want documents to find matches against. The URL can be as specific or general as you want. As you can see in the three examples, users can exclude an entire site, exclude all sources from a specific directory, or exclude a specific document. Use this page to manage the list of URLs that are filtered out of the matching content search when a report is being generated. If filters are applied to a folder, then they only apply to documents submitted within that folder. Now let's go to the Settings tab. Under General here, you can select the number of documents displayed on a given page within each folder. Choose what happens after a file is finished uploading. Adjust the time zone or language. Now click on the Documents tab here. You can choose how you would like documents to sort within a folder by Process Date, Document Title, Similarity Score, or by document author. You may also change the similarity percent threshold for when the color of the similarity score icon changes from gray to orange. Lastly, click on Reports. Here you will see email notification preferences. Use these settings to receive notification when a report has exceeded the specified thresholds below. You may set separate thresholds for the similarity report and for the content tracking report. An email will only be sent when a report exceeds the thresholds you set below. You can choose which report to display as the default and choose whether you would like a color-coded report. That's a quick look at how to set your account preferences. To watch more demos, visit authenticate.com resources.